friends, welcome back to my channel. It's Angela. Today's video is inspired by Deepika's look in Mohe Rangadola in Bajira Mastani. Um, I'm just making a drugstore look out of products that I have at home because I felt that a high-end makeup look would be too easy. Um, so I start off colour correcting with an orange lipstick shade under my eyes around my mouth and then I use a foundation that has a dewy finish, something brightening and luminescent so that I get that same uh, glowy skin that Deepika has as well. Then I use uh, a pressed powder that's a few shades darker than my skin and I put that on my uh, lid into the crease um, and also the outer V of my eye and on my lash line so that you just a natural brown because Deepika had very 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 natural eyes and then I put a coral shade on top of my lid uh, to give that healthy look which she had her her look was very very natural it was very subtle I'm making it a bit more defined then I use a highlighter in the middle of my lid to uh, have that natural sheen that she had on so you look like you have glowy skin and then uh, I do my waterline the lower waterline with a, a nude shade with a bit of shimmer in it you can use white as well uh, and then I blend everything out and then I curl my lashes and then put on black brown mascara so it looks really natural um, pay more attention to my upper lashes but I also do my lower lashes then I tight line the upper lash line with a brown uh, liner and once I'm done with that, I actually do my concealing. So I use a cream concealer under my eyes, around my mouth. And then I use a lighter cream concealer to do my highlighting. And also after that, I use a liquid concealer to do the brightening as well. So that would go on my brow bone, my forehead, down my nose bridge, my cupid's bow, my chin. Yeah, all those areas that you need to highlight. And then when I'm done with that, I use a brush to blend everything in, in patting motion. And once I'm done with the brush, I use a damp sponge to blend everything in once again. So that it looks more seamless and flawless. And then after that, I use uh, that same shade which I used on my eye. I put that into the hollows of my cheek, uh, my jawline, down my nose bridge to do my contouring. That depends on your face. And then... Um, it just looks more natural that way. Then I use that same damp sponge which I use on the concealer and I put that into my pressed powder and powder my whole face so that it looks really natural. There are no harsh lines. And then I do my brows. So for my brows, I use the brow wax more than the powder because she had a painted look um, which is better on film than in real life. So if you're going to wear this look in real life, then get rid of some of the thickness and the definition that I have here. Her uh, front of the brows are also rounded. Um, so just take note of that. And then I clean up my brows uh, with concealer. And when that's done, I do my blush. My blush is something like a highlighter it's more like a highlighter than a blush but it does have that pink as well which is very good for this look because Deepika did not look like she had any blush on at all but when the light hit her on the sides on her cheekbone you could see a bit of pink so uh, I get the same effect with this blush then I also use highlighter in all the areas that you need down your nose bridge uh, brow bone uh, high points of the cheek cupid's bow because um, the whole look is about a highlighted glowing face. And then I move on to the lips. The point of the lips is a brown lip liner. That's my opinion. Because even though she had the burnt coral sort of uh, shade on her lips, it was more on the brown side than on the orange side. And so um, I line the whole of my lip. And then after that, I use uh, two lipsticks. The one I have from Jordana is called Caribbean and I feel this shade is closer to what she had on but the finish is different because this one's more of a shimmery metallic shade and then uh, I have another one 
from Revlon is called Rose Wine and this one is more of a creamy matte shade so uh, after I put on uh, Jordana's lipstick I put this one on top you can use either one of these lipsticks and you'll get the same effect just make use of your brown liner to give you whatever shade you want and that's about it so I hope you liked this video you guys uh, I, I'll see you again in the next video thank you guys for watching see you guys bye